Hi friends, it's Gone Films and welcome to my first major BTS haul. Alright, so this video is a little bit different than my usual type of videos because, wait for it, I've decided to start collecting for BTS. Yeah! This may come as a surprise to you, but since I've been in ARMY, I haven't really bought like any albums or any DVDs or anything like that. I was more of like a casual streamer and yes, I did buy albums for my little sister and stuff and I enjoyed opening it and I enjoyed watching unboxing videos, but I never really bought any for myself just because I was like... I don't really listen to CDs. I don't think anyone does anymore. Um, I'm gonna look through this photo book like maybe once and like this photo card is gonna, you know, just sit there, whatever. Anyways, <laughs> that has changed. <laughs> and so now I'm like collecting all these albums and all these DVDs. Although honestly, I'm more into collecting like DVDs summer packages, winter packages, musters, things like that uh, rather than albums. I feel like albums, since they're more readily available, my priority for them is a lot lower. So I'm taking my time with those and that's more my sister's thing anyways. So I just buy albums for her. But as for me, I really, really love collecting DVDs because in my mind, like at least this money is going towards something that I can watch and enjoy on a DVD player. But Anyways, I decided to start collecting for BTS or as much as I can anyway because again, I'm still like a college student and I still have, you know, a couple, you know, part-time jobs here and there but I'm not by any means rich. I just saved up a lot and I decided to just go crazy with it and spend over $2,000 on BTS in like the span of two months which is sort of crazy but hear me out. I downloaded Mirakari and once I started, I literally could not stop. Like, oh my god, this app is so, so addicting. So I just kept scrolling and I was like, oh my god, there's such good deals and you can negotiate with the people that you're selling with and usually all the armies on there are super, super nice. So I was like, hey, listen, it's time to just dive in head first. This video is basically the first part of my major haul for BTS, which insinuates that there's a second part, but more on that later. So this video basically is my first two months of buying stuff and waiting for things to come in. Um, so that's like special albums, DVDs, uh, winter packages, summer packages, things like that. This was actually filmed sporadically from last August until like last fall-ish, and I've only started to film the intro and outro for this today which is like in the middle of January 2021 so you can tell how much of a procrastinator I am but nonetheless this video was basically compiled over a couple months which is why you'll see some awkward cuts and things like that and this is also my first haul video so I really didn't know what else to say besides ooh ah like <laughs> I'm just so awkward and there's a lot of ums and a lot of random pauses and just, I was trying to keep this all under 40 minutes, so I sped up parts of me just flipping through the photo book, and I cut out some parts, things like that. So I'm sorry in advance if this is the most unsatisfying unhauling, unhauling, unboxing video ever, but I promise the second one, when I get my second shipment for things, and so that's starting, um, like beginning of winter until now, when I get my second shipment slash second haul of things, I promise my unboxing will be so much better. But for now, please enjoy this very, very unsatisfying haul video of all my BTS goodies. All right, so first let's start off with the small stuff. I have this and I'm pretty sure I know what this is. I believe this is the winter package diary nam june's which i'm really freaking excited for i've been waiting so long for all of these to arrive um let's see here oh they packaged it up real nicely i'm so grateful but i'm just gonna rip it open oh and they included some freebies too i couldn't find winter package um 2020 
anywhere <laughs> for some reason so i ended up buying these two separately so this is just the photo book and then we'll unbox the um full thing in just a sec but this is Nam June's 2020 winter package book. This is so beautiful. Oh my gosh. I had this photo as my lock screen for months after this was released. This is amazing. Oh my god. And these are my alts. Oh, I, this is why I had to get this book. I just had to because, wow. These are all my favorite people. Aww. Stay strong this year too. Here's to your health. Aww. I love him. This is beautiful. And up next, I believe I know what this is. This should be a Namjoon photo card, if I'm correct. Yes, oh my goodness. All right, so. See, and this also came with really cute freebies and really, really delicate packaging that I love. Thank you. This is why Marikari is like so good. All right. This is a namjoon freebie photo card from summer package 2017 i believe super cute that she did that and also this card thank you so much for your purchase i hope namjoon arrives to you safely please let me know when he gets to you by leaving a review i did leave a review when it came so yeah i'm just filming this now but oh he's here and i love how she taped up the card real nicely and put it in like a top loader. This is Namjoon's um, City Field New York DVD um, photo card. I've been wanting this for literally so long and um, yeah in some cases just buying um, the photo card and the DVD separate is actually cheaper than trying to buy it together. Um, so yeah, this is one of the cases. This is so cute. Oh my god Guys, I've literally wanted this for so long. I was at the um, City Field date when they first came and When I found out that they were selling the DVD, I was so freaking excited, but I could never justify like Spending money on it and now that I decided to start like collecting the DVDs as much as I can um I'm really really happy that I have him now oh my goodness I'm so happy up next is this literal hunk of a package that was so ridiculous to get in the mail literally so ridiculous um, anyone who ordered map of the soul merch you know how it came this is like literally ridiculous so actually it came in a big bag like this and then it was folded up into fours and I was like, what the heck did I order? I was so confused when this came because I was like, I don't remember ordering anything this massive. Turns out, it was just, I literally only ordered this one single thing and it came in this huge packaging. I feel so bad for the environment. So this will somehow get recycled if I send out um, something to somebody or like whatever. I just feel so bad for wasting all of this plastic and all of this packaging. It's Map of the Soul tour mini photo cards i'm excited Ooh, okay oh these are big these are not the size of normal photo cards i did not realize wow oh my gosh the visuals y'all look so good Ooh, okay it feels so good to finally open all of these because these have been sitting in my room for so long now we're getting to the big stuff so this <laughs> is the new york city field dvd the blu-ray version yes okay so this is the <laughs> yeah city field dvd or blu-ray version only because i actually found someone who was selling the blu-ray version for cheaper than people who were selling the dvd so yeah i have the um photo card for the dvd but then i have the actual like disc the blu-ray version <laughs> you can see like it's not damaged at all um it's really nice so i'm gonna try to open this the best i can Ooh, okay so this is the photo book for that oh just kidding this is the dvd and i really like how it looks um similar to the answer album um i think it's really pretty 
It's prone to get scratches though. Like I can see there's a couple scratches on here, but that's totally fine. And here are the two discs. And then there's the set list in the back. And yeah, a couple more scratches here. But again, that's totally fine with me. Another reason why I wanted to get the Blu-ray version is because I really like um, the card that they have. This is really, really super freaking cute. Um, and then the back too. I like how the back is matte, but then the front is glossy. And then this, I believe, is the small photo book. Yeah. I'm really, really happy to have this now because I've been watching this for literal ages ever since it was announced. Up next, we have this hunk, which also is from Mirakari. Um, <laughs> well, this is packaged so well. I'm totally keeping like the tissue paper because this is great. And she also really, really nicely bubble wrapped all of this. So I'm just gonna unravel. We have two layers, oh, three layers, I think, that I see anyway. I'm just gonna slip this out. <laughs> as well. Oh my gosh, okay, it's here. I've been wanting this for so long and it's quite heavy. Alrighty. And I really like how they customize like the box, the inside of the box as well. It's like very, very nice detail. Um, so here we have the making DVD. And here is the photos. And I like how they packaged this up as well. Like all the packaging is so beautiful. I love this shade of green. Um, but yes, these are all such good quality. And they look so beautiful as always, but still. Wow. Oh my gosh, they look so good. And this is the like lenticular holographic thing. I won't take it out just because you can see it here, but yeah, really, really cool. I don't think any of this has been opened, honestly. But yeah, so this is the ring, I believe that you can, yeah, this hasn't been made either, so I won't. <laughs> open it just because I'm a wuss. Um, even the book, oh my god. Wait. Yeah, everything is still in its original packaging. This is awesome. I did not expect this. Yeah. So the book is even in the original like plastic wrap. So I'm going to open that now. Um, if I can. But yeah, it's just another way to ensure like um, authenticity and um, you know, like mint condition. Um, but I did not even remember that this was like all plastic wrap. Very thick. Um, you can tell a lot of time and effort um, went into, you know, making this book and um, the photo shoots for it. have this little like photo thing I think it's really creative how they package this so you just pull it out and there's photos here so cool how they did this oh there's so much I didn't realize oh my gosh it's like a mini surprise and then in the back are some just general scenery photos which I think was a nice touch just for us to appreciate you know the sights and everything I know there's perforations on this so you could technically um, rip these out but I'm not going to because that's just not my style <laughs> the next thing I have here which I'm really 
excited about is first <laughs> some freebies from this Miracari seller. They were so sweet. I'm not gym and biased, but I do appreciate <laughs> all this. But the important part of the package is <sighs> summer package. 2019. I'm super duper duper excited about this. I bought this from Mercari for I think only $55. Um, yeah, and another reason why I like this is because they still had the plastic covering um, on the box here. So let me just take this off. You can see it's brand new and I love the little holographic thing they have in there. Of course, it's very prone um, to, you know, fingerprints and all that but honestly I don't mind at all um, as long as there's no scratches or anything that's what matters to me the most and so you can take the lid off here first thing we have here is the fan which honestly I don't see myself using at all except maybe in desperate measures or desperate circumstances here it's really really adorable i think i think it's very um royal looks very professional just this 2019 summer package in korea there and it also has this cute little charm that you can attach um to the little key ring here but it has the bts logo and the army logo and then the next thing is the mini posters here So they have one big poster, it's matte, so it's not glossy, which I appreciate. Um, so it has the beautiful scenery behind them, and the seven of them there, and then also a close-up here. They look so freaking beautiful, and this poster is really, really good quality as well. And also, they have the mini posters, and these are glossy, and so I'll do a quick flip through of them here. They look so beautiful. Oh my gosh. And they all have, you know, pretty dark hair. I love this look on them, the brown. Oh my gosh. Yep. Then there's this um, accordion style page of them. They all look so freaking beautiful and dreamy and glossy. Um, but yeah, this is also sort of matte. And then the back has their cute little designs on it and there's this sort of protective covering over it. it's almost sort of waterproof and they also have the making dvd this is also a matte covering here um, looks so beautiful the last thing they have here is the photo book this book just feels like such good quality and i love the design of it as well That's pretty much all that came in this summer package. I have the diary as well, which should be coming in a couple days. So when I get that, you guys will see it as well. We're gonna open up. This is Memories of 2019. I know Korea got this a while ago, but honestly, this arrived pretty fast. Um, Pre-order was a month ago, and exactly a month ago now, I got the order. So here we go, the box and the packaging. The package is up nicely as well. I'm so excited. <gasps> okay. This is such a pretty color. So this is the pre-order gift that you got if you ordered it off of um, Weverse. I wasn't sure if this came with Weverse uh, USA shop. So what happened was I actually ordered this on the USA shop first. And then my friend who ordered it from um, Globo shop was like, hey, did you notice the pre-order gift? And I was like, what gift? So then I had to cancel my USA one and order this on Global. So I believe this is just like a mini picture frame, but I love this color so much. It's like a peach coral. It says Weaver Shop on it. Um, it's just cardboard, but it still feels nice. And then I believe you just fold this and you put it on the stand here. There you go. 
so yeah really cute this looks very similar to um memories of 2018 so i think they're just trying to stick with the theme and then change up the color uh, i believe this is like the pantone color of the year so that's really sweet let's see what photo card we got i'm super excited what is this this is so cute So this is, I believe, just, um, oh, a flip book thing. Oh, this is so cute. I believe this was from Summer Package, um, one of theirs, uh, Map of the Soul Dates, Boy With Love, um, MV shooting. And in the back, um, we have the Army Zip membership shooting, I believe, and 2020 Seasons readings. Oh, this is so nice. We have, oh, I see him. <laughs> Sorry, I just kind of ignored this for a bit. Hold on. Special Memories Book of 2019. Oh, this is another flip book. This is so sweet. Okay, so kind of ruined it there, but here's the photo card for that. Just says memories of 2019. So cute. it for memories of 2019 okay we're on to our last two packages which honestly i'm really really excited for and i bought memories of 2019 from weverse i bought this at the same time it was all within like the same day i literally spent like over 500 dollars within 24 hours it's crazy let's open up memories of 2017 first i'm most excited for this so this is significantly smaller than Memories of 2018 and Memories of 2019. I still have yet to um, purchase Memories of 2018. That should be soon. So I can't compare all three of them together yet, but definitely um, smaller than Memories of 2019. Let's see who we got. We got Jin again. Holy crap. What are the odds of this? Oh my God, he's so cute. I forgot when this was taken. What are the odds? This is so funny. DVDs. Now on to the last big thing. Here it is, uh, Summer Package 2018. I'm super, super excited for this. So let's see who we get. Maybe it'll be Jin again, who knows? So again, it's really satisfying to rip off the plastic packaging because that's how you know it's legit. And here it is, okay. I think it is so cool how they package this. It is so unique. I got the white version, although I know there is also the black version. I just like the white exterior. Um, so let's see here. I'm gonna unzip it. Let's see who we get. I'm excited. 
Okay. Actually, I'll save that for later. So here is the photo book and of course lots of padding inside. So no worries about it slipping and sliding. I'm gonna um, open this first just to keep the suspense going. <laughs> um, so here is the photo book. Let's see if I can open this. Alrighty, we got it open. I'm excited to see. I had previously watched unboxings of these like a year and a half ago but I totally forget so I'm excited to see and on the the photo book is like a matte feeling except for the little floaties that the boys are sitting on these are like a different texture so I think that's really cool let's flip through I really really love the aesthetic that they um, had for this summer package is nice and bright colorful they're at the beach um, tropical I just really really love the look of this I just really love this whole aesthetic that they had here. Alrighty, so grand reveal. Here it goes. Who did we get? <gasps> oh my gosh, I see him. I see him. We got Tay. Yay, yay, yay. I'm going to open this though. Oh my gosh, he looks so good. So Tay is one of my alts, so I'm very, very excited. Although BTS is like my alt group anyway, so honestly, I don't mind whoever I got. But yeah, again, this is uh, the matte texture, same as the photo book, and then Tay's face is more of a glossy feel. Oh my gosh! Three days in Saipa. Wow. Oh, I'm so, so happy about this. Honestly, I would have been happy with anyone, but especially happy that it was Tay. Alrighty, and then we have the strap. Honestly, not gonna use this much, um, but yeah, it's white because it came with the white suitcase. I'm sure you could latch this on to the zipper or something like that, but if you got the black version, then you got a black wristband. Um, and it says beyond the scene in purple. Then we have this little, I think it's a standee, like a photo prop thing, which I'm also not going to open because I don't think I have a reason to. And here is the, uh, the posters. I also saw people selling these on Mercari for a ridiculous price, so definitely be careful. I just think buying the full set from somewhere is easier at times. Again, sometimes buying, you know, this photo book and then the um, summer package separately is cheaper, but other times it's like ridiculous what people sell these for. So it looks so good. Um, and it says their name in the back. Wow, wow, wow. They look amazing. And last but not least, here is the probably the most, the least exciting portion is the 2018 Summer Package DVD. Um, yeah, it's the same design as their photo book. I really like the metallic look of it. You can see there, it's pretty metallic. So just to recap, there was the DVD poster, which I'll just put them all in here. The guidebook, the standee, and also a strap. So I keep saying that this is gonna be the last package and I keep lying to myself because I keep ordering more. So we have a few more things to unbox. So the first of which is on my pile is the School Love Affair Special Edition. Let's open it and see who we get. 
so I am very prone to getting gin as a photo card so I hope it's another member this time just because we've had gin a couple times it's nice to see this is so cute okay and then they have two so it looks like see one DVD just like fell out the case before I even touched it so I wonder how well like they packaged this to begin with but this is really really cool I'm gonna watch this later and I love the cute little bow so I'm gonna move this to the side and I haven't looked through this photo book at all so this will be very exciting to see Oh my gosh, we got Taeyang! Oh, This is a lot, it's a different quality than I thought it would be. It's like, I don't know, plasticky? It's not paper, so, oh my goodness. Yay, I'm so, so happy. so sweet and I got Tang. so this also came with a rolled up poster which I thought was nice of them and this is it oh how cute so the next thing I have which I'm really excited for is BTS world tour love yourself speak yourself in Wembley so I'm just gonna cut this real quick one thing I love ordering about uh, ordering from Weavers is that they always bubble wrap everything super well. So yeah, this is their London date, um, uh, June 1st to June 2nd at Wembley. So let's open this up and see. The box opens up like this. It's magnetic. So cool. And here are the... <gasps> oh my god! I got Yoongi! Oh, he's so cute! This photo card is a lot bigger than I thought it would be. It takes up pretty much the whole box, but oh my goodness! And it has a seven of, seven of them looking out at the crowd. Oh my gosh, I'm so happy about this. And so here is the DVD for that. Um, I love the look. Love it, love it, love it. And I love like the background too of Wembley. Um, yeah, pretty much the same as the DVD cover case and then there's this poster which is glossy on one side and matte on the other side this is so cute I love the fact that they included a poster this time you can see them all so well and then this is just an overview of the whole stadium this looks like it's during idol the photo book is pretty thick and it feels nice to hold as well How beautiful is that? I'm so excited to watch this. I have seen so many YouTube videos, but it's gonna hit so differently um, when I watch this on my own. Second to last thing is I, <laughs> while I was buying <laughs> um, the London DVD, I just thought, you know, I still need this album in my collection. Um, like I said before, I'm not really an album collector, but since I was paying for shipping um, internationally anyway, I just thought, hey, might as well order this version because my sister has the dark version. I'm super, super excited because I love how they did the Polaroids for this album as well. And the Young Forever um, aesthetic is just so, so pleasing. So I'm just going to shake it out here. Up in the box. So... Here is the two DVDs for that. They look so beautiful. And here is the folded poster. 
super cool and it's like this matte texture as well here is the album itself i'm excited to see who i get let's see i love 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 this aesthetic so so much look at him oh my god <laughs> see i'm so prone to getting gin with everything i'm not sure what it is this unboxing but he looks so good look at his hair oh my gosh so yeah we got gin for this one uh i and it's glossy too which i enjoy wow and the last thing i have is 2020 season's greetings i thought i would buy it now just because 2020 is almost ending so i'm assuming that they're gonna put out a 2021 season's greetings soon i love mint green or like the teal-ish look i love this color and i love the iridescent look they have and I like how they um, covered this up in the plastic for protection as well. So the corners are all fine. Always perfect with um, Weaver shipping. Um, so let's, I don't know how to best open this. Oh, okay. Here it is. Okay, I, I love the packaging as well. Like this is so cute. Okay, I don't know how much of that saved because I didn't realize it ended. <laughs> but I've opened up the season's greetings. So what we're doing is we're just looking over the journal here um, and journaling has really, really made an impact um, this year. So I'm glad that whoever bought this at the beginning of the year, like they could have this throughout. Um, but I really just like the aesthetic. So they have, you know, the calendar, the overview, yearly plan, sort of like um, a future log. And then it goes by month. And then during the month, it has like this cute little birthday message, but I can't read that. So <laughs> it has photos towards the end, which I find just so beautiful. I remember when this first dropped and we all sort of went wild on the timeline, especially about Jin's mullet. That was iconic. And uh, the Kim line just, they look so beautiful. So they have the making DVD here, um, which I actually didn't watch when it came out um, first. So I'm really, really excited to watch this. And I just love the colors so much. This is like my favorite season's greetings that they've done so far. I think this might be Yoongi, I don't know, let's see. Oh my God, yes, it is a Yoongi lenticular. This is so cute and I love how they did um, uh, a lenticular as well instead of a photo card but this is so so cute we are getting yungi a lot today so i'm really really happy about that the next thing is also these little postcards and i really like how um creative they went with this too like this clear message thing you can switch them around between the different members if you wanted to but this is just so cool how they packaged it These, I believe, are just posters. These, I believe, are just stickers, which I find so cute. I don't know if I'll ever get myself to use these, although I know the point of buying this is to use them. It's just hard to get yourself to use these when they're so adorable. Like, just look at them. Oh my goodness. I really, really do want to use these, but I just, oh, they're just so precious. Like, these, are we kidding? Everyone's so cute. And then their photo IDs, which I always thought, like, I don't know what I would do with these photos. I don't know. <laughs> I don't know, maybe. Maybe it's a me thing. I just, I never know what to use 
with these photos. <laughs> like they're just cardboard pieces. Um, they, I don't know what to do with them. I don't know. Lastly, they have, oh, and this is also individually wrapped. So that's new, that's exciting. So I believe this is just a calendar. back to the outro didn't I tell you that was the most unsatisfying unboxing video ever yeah I know I'm so so sorry um, I will try to do better on my next one I finally have some practice and I've been watching so many unboxing videos so I definitely will step up my game next time thank you so much for watching me make bad financial decisions but decisions that were good for the soul nonetheless if you liked it which I hope you did please hit that subscribe button for more my next few videos I have planned are my BTS light stick customization video and also my BTS photo card collecting video because yes, I decided to start collecting for Nam June, which is yet another bad financial decision, but we are in a pandemic and I am bored and I have nothing else to do with my life besides work and BTS. So <laughs> here we are. <laughs> If you have any suggestions on any other BTS videos I should make, please leave a comment down below. I'd love to hear what you thought of this video and what you would like to see in the future. Thanks so much for watching. I'll see you in the next video. Bye!